Hi everyone, it's Claire here and today I'm going to be doing a review on Dimple's Secret Garden. Um, her range of cloth pads is called Dimple Muff. I purchased this pad along with the Honor Your Flow pads from another reusables company that stocks this brand of pads wholesale on their website. As to get one of these pads, it's about a 14 to 21 day wait as they are all made to order. And I figured, well, as I was getting a few other things, this is a great opportunity to get one a lot quicker. So I ordered a 10 inch medium flow, 2.75 inches once snapped, organic cotton top, two layers of Zorb core, hidden PUL and a back of cotton flannel. So this is the card that came with it. I love this logo. I think she's recently rebranded, so it could be different now. Here is a guide to snap colours and absorbency, as well as website, Facebook and Facebook group. So that comes in handy. Now to the pad. I have not been looking forward to doing this review as I have quite a few problems with this pad and when I do reviews I like to try and find the positives or if something hasn't worked for me then generally there's someone out there it will work for but when this arrived I was deeply disappointed I would say at best this is second quality for a pad if we take a look here you can see the stitching join here is really really visible and off the core is also sewn on very unevenly we've got a massive bit here compared to a tiny bit here if we go to the other end of the pad it is misshapen along here the stitching is again uneven and comes to a point here and heads up it's uneven on the wings and it's also uneven on the core down here again very small here bigger here it's just really not a good quality of stitching so that on first glance was very disappointing then as with all the pads I plan to review I measured it when it arrived this was meant to be a 10 inch and it came in at just over 9.5 after three washes and two uses it's still coming in at 9.5 so there was no extra shrinkage thank goodness but it actually arrived half an inch shorter it is meant to snap on the 2.75 however it actually snaps on the 2.5 and it arrived that way also so there has been no shrinkage with this pad but it came the wrong measurements the back is cotton flannel but I have to say it is the roughest flannel Ellen's been with this pad the roughest flannel that I have and pretty much most of my pads are flannel or cord back. See if I can get this to focus on the flannel. There. It's already had a lot of pilling. And that's not after much washing at all. That's just three washes on 30 and being air dried. But it is really rough. I don't think the camera will pick it up. But it is super rough. The actual cotton topper is not much better and is also quite rough and the pad itself is a moderate flow but is pretty thick to be moderate so if you like thick pads then this would definitely be for you but this is quite thick and bulky and it's right to the ends so it really showed through what I was wearing and it felt really really uncomfortable and stiff in my underwear the um Obviously I did the pre-wash, then I wore it and washed it again. And after that wash, I thought maybe it would soften up if I put it in the dryer for just five minutes. And it did not soften it up, sadly. So it is a very stiff, bulky pad that I found uncomfortable. Um, 
But for me, the worst part definitely has to be this stitching. I mean, if I had purchased this as a second quality pad, then fair enough. But this is in no way first quality. My hope is that this is kind of a dud that maybe got through inspection when she was doing her wholesale order. Um, I would like to purchase more and see if this is the quality across the board, but I really don't feel confident buying any more because I will not uh, use this pad as it just is not suitable for me. And I can't destash it as a first. I'd have to destash it as a second and lose quite a bit of money on it. So sadly, this is really not my favourite review that I've had to do. But the whole point of being a reviewer is to actually say the truth. So this is what this pad is like. It is very disappointing. She does have good reviews on her Facebook page and I have no doubt a lot of people love her pads. So like I say, I'm hoping that I just got a dud, quite frankly, because, you know, her pads look great in the photos, etc. And I'm sure many people adore her pads. So, but I can only really review what's here in front of me. So that's it from me on this video um check out my on your flow review that i have uploaded at the same time that is a awesome pad and i will speak to you soon